Hello and welcome to another video on direct query and in this video we are going to discuss can we use related indirect query okay so let's go to power bi in power bi i have this data model where i have this sales table and i have a few dimensions around it now uh, these dimension which you are seeing with the uh, uh, line on the top highlighted line on the top they are indirect query and i do have a table which is not indirect query the date table now what we need to see is can we bring in a table call um, column from these tables which are on one side to many side now related work only from one side to many side uh, that we know so we are going to try out that so let me do one thing I, i'm going to go to the sales table let me uh, bring here a page and in this page uh, let me bring in um, order number and let me make it not summarized okay so i got all the order numbers now what i would like to do here is i would like to let's say bring from item table i want to bring let's say brand so i can bring brand and i can check what brand is that for this order number so i create a new column and with this new column i say sales brand and i say related and it's showing that function first of all related item brand so i got related item brand i create this column this column is created and i can go and bring it into the visual so i dragged it it came into the visual and what we can do is we can validate by bringing in brand from the item table so we bought and these is going to be same because the same thing we are getting so we are able to bring it and we can use it also and this is in direct query we are using now i have one table which is basically the table which is not in direct query the date table this is a power bi calculated date table can i use that let's try out that let's see what happens so i go i create a new column and i say related and it is showing date here so i go here and i say related date month now it shows the column date month either does not exist or do not have any relationship of the table with the current context now there is a relationship these two table do have a relationship but this is in the import mode this is in the direct query mode so this is not going to work out okay fine so we have tried out related so related can work but you should only use related very selectively uh, to do any task this is a function where uh, we bring in data from one side of the table to the many side of the table uh, but uh, it can have some performance impact so we should try to avoid uses of related okay so go ahead and try that out do let us know what else you want us to cover in this particular series thanks for watching this video thank you